Hey guys, uh, Michael Di Diego with Industrial Safety Supply Corporation. Uh, today we're going to uh, walk through um, the Mini Ray 3000 and how to apply a correction factor. Uh, you'll notice uh, right down here on the screen that um, currently our correction factor is set equal to one. Uh, we're calibrating to isobutylene, um, looking for isobutylene. So uh, what we're going to go ahead and do is uh, apply the in and mode button to get into our main menu and uh, we're going to mode over to our measurement gas and we're going to select a measurement gas. I'm going to hit select and I'm just going to go to my list and the first one's isobutylene so let's just scroll down here to benzene and hit select and I'm going to hit save and then I'm going to go ahead and back out And update settings and what you're going to see next is you're going to see a correction factor a factor equal uh, to 0 0.53 which is the correction factor for benzene uh, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to apply a hundred ppm of isobutylene to uh, our instrument um, just so you can see what the difference is in readings I'm then going to change it back and show you uh, the actual readings that show a hundred ppm of readings so you can see it's pretty spot on uh, at 0.53 the correction factor. So I'm going to go ahead and take this off. And what we're going to do is we're going to apply the uh, isobutylene correction factor of 1 back on there just so that you can see that it automatically applies that correction factor to your reading. Let's go back over to measurement. Go back to measurement gas. We'll go to my list and we will select isobutylene and save and we'll back out of this again you'll notice that the correction factor is now one again I'm going to go ahead and apply some isobutylene gas at 100 ppm and once it stabilizes it should be pretty close And there you go. I'm going to go ahead and pull the gas off. And that's how you apply a correction factor uh, calibrating to isobutylene. Thanks for coming and have a great and safe day.